Well, uh, we hear it all the time. Breakfast is the most important meal of the day. But did you know that eating a nutritious breakfast could also lead to academic success? And just in time for back to school, here to tell us more about this through the milk campaign is Lania Paulette from Palm Springs Unified School District along with Toma and Max from Desert Hot Springs High School. Welcome, thank you for joining us this morning. Thank you for having us. So why is it so challenging for students to eat breakfast? I mean, what could be the worst that could happen to them if they don't have breakfast? Well, about one third of students do not eat breakfast, um, spe especially in high school. The students like to hang out with their friends, sleep in, finish up their homework. Um, so there's a lot of reasons why especially high school students do not eat breakfast. So what is this Got Milk Challenge and uh, how are our local schools involved with this? Well, we have three high schools in the district, Palm Springs High, Cathedral City High, and then Desert Hot Springs High. And the three high schools uh, for the last four years compete against each other to uh, win a competition on who can eat the most breakfast. So we have a three-week competition and keep track of how many students are uh, getting breakfast in the cafeteria and then whichever school wins that the students for their schools win um, money and then the students then can choose what to do with that money like dances and those types of things. Okay well Toma if you can tell us about this billboard contest that's going on how does it work? From now until October 12th Got Milk is sponsoring a competition for 13 to 8 year old students where they can mail in photos of themselves enjoying breakfast and that leads to to prizes yeah, and yeah, money prizes okay. money rewards so uh mm -hmm. what's your favorite breakfast um my favorite breakfast is an apple uh -huh. and uh the breakfast bars that we have at school mm -hmm. you know, i've actually heard apples is very good for you it helps kicks up the metabolism it's very healthy it's a good snack for breakfast what about you max what do you like I like apples. You like apples too, okay. <laughs> Max, you're gonna do a, a, a got milk shake for us. Uh, what, what is it you're making, can you tell us? Well, we got bananas. Bananas. And we have vanilla yogurt. Vanilla yogurt. Put that in there. Yeah, pineapple juice. And some pineapple juice. Sounds yummy. Yeah. Okay. And we have some milk. So while he's doing that, uh, Lania, let me ask you, mm -hmm. so what should students be eating? What kind of breakfast items should they be eating to kick up their learning? Well, every time that students eat, they should always have some form of calcium, whether it's milk, yogurt, cheese, um, because they're, they're still growing all through high school. So it's very important to always include milk. And then it's also important to always include a produce item, either uh, fruits or vegetables. Okay, Max, let that thing whip real quick. We're gonna go to the full screen right now and tell people how they can find out more about this. If you wanna find out, go ahead, whip it up. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, go and pour that. So if you want to learn more about the uh, Got Milk Breakfast Challenge, all you have to do is go to our website at kmir6.com where you will find a link to the contest. And Max is already whipping up the breakfast there. Now, if you had a camera at Toma, you could probably take a picture and send that in. All right, so we're going to go and send this right back to you, Gloria. All right, well, thank you so much. Looks like a good treat there. All right, well, stay with us. We will be right back.